hi guys welcome back to the channel today we're going to give you an update on the southern coastal highway improvement project and we are going to look at the section um, where they're building a highway from Harborview to Yalos. Now the entire project is to build a highway from Harborview to Port Antonio in Portland. So Harborview is in St. Andrew through St. Thomas into Portland. But they're building it in sections. So the highway actually starts at the end of this bridge. This is the Harborview Bridge. So the government announced recently that the section of the highway between Harborview or the Harborview Bridge and the Yalos Bridge will be completed by the end of April. Today is April 9th, April 10th. So we are going to give you an update to see how far they've reached with, the, um, with this highway. Now, the section between Harborview and the Yalos Bridge is going to be four lanes. It's going to be a dual carriageway with a concrete barricade in the middle. So, although this section is already four lanes, this, no work has been done out here. It was always four lanes. There is no concrete barricade up here yet. So, we're going to continue and you guys can decide if this road will be finished by the end of April which is what call it three weeks and we're going to come out here every week until the end of April to give you guys the update so you'll get weekly updates between now and the end of April all right so the alignment for this section of the highway is between the Harborview Bridge and Buff Bay or Bull Bay sorry guys I don't know why I keep mixing up those two names but 11 miles I think it's all right, I'm going to tell you soon 11 miles Bull Bay the highway is going to run along the existing roadway so this road that you're looking at now is going to be extended and upgraded so this road will become four lanes from here to Bull Bay 11 miles Bull Bay right okay so there you can see on the right now the structures have been removed because that's where the additional two lanes are going to go in. and some places it will be on the left some places it will be on the right so a lot of structures had to be removed for the building or the expansion of this road to four lanes I mean, based on what I'm looking at, I just don't see it happening in three weeks. China Harbor Engineering Company is the contractor. I mean, the space is there. Clearly, you can see the space has been cleared to put in the additional two lanes, but I don't know if you can put in so much, do so much work in three weeks. I mean, there, there are sections of this road between the Harbor View and the Yalas Bridge that are complete. We have videos up, you can check it out. And we're going to drive all the way to the Yalas Bridge today. So there you can see on the right. Now I had mentioned in another video that the roads, the roadway is not leveled. Like on the right, it's higher than the section we're driving on now. And somebody mm -hmm. noted that they don't need to be level because it's going to have the concrete barricade separating them so that's a good point and there you can see on the right the new walls went up because they had to they had to take down the structures that were there But this just seems like a lot of work to be done in three weeks. And you notice you haven't seen one worker in this section, not one tractor, nothing, nothing going on in this sec um, on this section of the road between the Harbor View Bridge and 11 miles in Bull Bay.
Now the entire project is scheduled to be finished in 2025. That's the road from Harborview from St. Andrew all the way to Port Antonio. Some sections it's going to be four lanes, some sections it's going to be two lanes. Okay, there you can see on the right is another bridge that was built to accommodate the addition of two lanes. And there you can see the roadway. Okay, now we can see the Jersey barrier to separate both sides of the road. There it is on the right. Now I'm wondering if they meant one side of the road will be finished, like two lanes will be finished by the end of April. But even then, I don't see two, I mean, perhaps they, were, they meant one side of the road would be finished because where we are driving now, there, I don't see this finishing by the end of April. Not even, I don't even see one side of the road, two lanes being finished by the end of April. Look at the amount of work they have to do out here. And if they were trying to meet an April deadline, they would be working today. Okay guys, let us know what you think about the April deadline. And it was a government official who said it in Parliament. The exact words were practical completion by April, by the end of August 2023. So clearly somebody must have told that person. Actually, it was the Prime Minister who said it. The Prime Minister said it in his, in his, when he was in Parliament. We actually have a video up of the entire speech and it was reported so you can check that out to, to see if exactly what was said there's a track on the left it's parked there i don't see any work going on today so you can see where the additional lanes are going to go in now this is a very good project it has it's what you call a game changer for this side of the island without a doubt this, these roads were needed i'm not sure why they would say april 2023 a subscriber had said they misspoke and they meant april 2024 but i think it will be finished long before that but as we said we'll keep giving you guys weekly updates because I'm not sure where the miscommunication came from. Somebody must have told the Prime Minister April Alright guys, thanks for taking the tour with us. Remember to like, share and subscribe. And leave your comments in the section below. I want to know what you think about the completion of this road. Alright guys, have a good day.